All right, guys, thank you for tuning in again. I'm super excited about this one. Uh, this is part two of me and Brandon's trip to the Trinity River in central Texas. I'll link part one below where we caught a true monster fish. And in this one right here, part two, we are literally chasing fish that are bigger than we are. Thank you for watching. All right, guys, we got, we got to another spot. We drove the kayaks for maybe 45 minutes. But the, the energy in this area is, is very different than our last spot. It's a lot quieter and we've only seen a couple fish come up, but they're huge. There is fish six, seven, maybe even eight foot right out in front of us. One of them just came up right by my float. We are, we are in an area with literally monsters right now. So Heck yeah, we, are. we can just, just feel the tension in the air. And, uh, they right are, after right after a big rain yes it just stopped. drenched on us that's why we look just so amazing right <laughs> now we're gonna get one of these guys yeah we are it's a matter of time it's just a matter of time let's go all right here's another attempt at bridling a bait let's see if this works Brandon's eating his sandwich and has a pretty serious run yeah, on the, the bait cast setup. Sure Get in front of him, bro. Get in front of him. Oh, look at him. He's flying. I'm going to get our necessities here. Look, yeah, I know it's hard to see, guys, but the float is just flying. So the run started back here. See that? What? He just like head shook twice. That was him chomping it. This could be a, this could be a good fish. What's cool, guys? It's on the Cast King Meg swim bait rod. Dude, basically a big bass setup. I like the reel it's too. It's a size 400 Dial Alexa musky reel. Look at it go. Yeah, and you can see right here. That's what's going on. Something. That was about a six and a half, seven foot. It might be going right for that float, guys. That was something. That was about a six and a half, seven foot. <sighs> All right, we're gonna give this a shot here. See what's going on. Give it business. We got her. It ain't made any runs yet. Oh, jeez. Oh. Uh -oh. oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, will you take my, take my GoPro for me and just film me? Yeah. Thank you. I'm watching those floats too, don't worry. Those. We're good. <laughs> hey Ty, you might have something pretty good on. Oh, it ain't small, buddy. Oh, we did it, buddy. We did it? We got a big thing. Not that big. Not that small either. Man, that ate the head. It ate the head, man, you're right. That is pretty cool. Hey, I'm man. a bait caster. Mm -hmm. Got her? Yeah. Let me see. Oh. It might not be anywhere near done yet. Man, this guy puts on a fight. Uh oh. What 
when he's here, don't pull. Just let him do whatever he's gonna do. And he'll do that. You good? Oh, oh man! This is going crazy. Dude, what is with this fish? You see both of our fucks? No. No, I don't. Oh, I see it going here. It's going? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Just keep him entertained. Oh my gosh. Both. Both are going. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Both. Both are going. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I also got to get those. Oh, what a time to be alive, ladies and gentlemen. What a time to be alive. All right. Well, we're back to it. Ty's fighting two fish right now. Well, not fighting. He's just taking care of two runs. Still got Gary on the line over here. Oh man. Look at them both taking off. All right, what should we do? I don't know. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Oh my gosh, what are we doing with our lives? Quick. <laughs> All right, he's coming right back. Go. Yep, yep. All right, guys. Not a monster, but they're getting bigger. Look at that beautiful alligator gar. He is flawless and he put up an incredible fight. We've got two good fish running. We're gonna go take care of them right now and let this guy go. Gary, uh, is it? Yeah, I named him Gary. These releases are so cool. Let's go. All right, let's go take care of these guys. This one. This one's going back up. Oh, you got that one? So you got that one. Where's the float? Is the float even, do you even see the float? Yes, okay. it's right next to it. Okay. They both got fish on them. I don't think we are either, somehow. You wanna, yours is going, man. Give him the beans. He's going away from you. It's still good. So? Yeah. Look at the boil. Watch your line. It, it looked like a five. It took your bait, I, I think. No, dude, I thought it was like a snap. Like the line broke or something broke. You serious? Yeah. Wow, you're right. Bait's gone? All right, mine's going up now. It should be a done deal. Let's get my footing here. So slippery, man. This might be a freak. Not sure how big yet. Just have some big head shakes. Oh, 
Thanks, though. Ooh. Wow. Holy. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. That might be a six. Oh, man. That's big, buddy. I'm going to call that trip made right there. Ooh. Yeah, it's a much better fish. Man, not quitting, huh? Oh man, that's so fun. There you go. I'm lifting the head up a little bit. So, so Brandon, when they do this, we'll keep the head in the water and don't pull. So just, just let them fit. Just like that. That's perfect, right there. Wow. Good. Whoa! All right, still green. Is there a drop off? Not yet. Oh, it looks pretty droppy. I might sit here. Oh, come on. <laughs> Look where I am. I know. I really want to be there. <laughs> there we go. We got our six foot alligator. <laughs> We got our six foot alligator gar, guys. And, oh my gosh. Can't wrangle this thing. Oh, so much fun. Good girl. Such a cool fish. This one is in perfect shape. Look at her, her big old paddle right there. Always a pleasure. And these fish are not alligators they are fish all they want to do is get away from you they do not want to harm you they do not want to bite you i've been catching gar for a while with my buddy henry who kind of taught me how to do this and knows a lot about them but we've swam next to hundreds of these fish and as i'll show you now i'll swim this fish out they are not trying to hurt you they just want to be Well done. All right, guys, we just brought our last bait in for the day. Take a look at this. Notice just how many holes there are, how torn up this is. And what's weird is all the scales are missing. The fish got a hold of that. We did not Actually, catch the fish. Yeah. The last scale right there. That's crazy. Guard just out there chomping on it. They just tenderized that meat. They really did. Jeez. Yeah. But we had an incredible day. Got on some big fish, probably a little over six was our biggest one, right around 100 pounds. Yep. Then some other fish as well. Hope y'all enjoyed this two-part series. Me and Brandon decided we had a ton of fun and we're gonna start doing this more often. And we will get one soon that makes six foot look small. Thank y'all so. for watching. Let's do it. See y'all.